10 years old. Man, it's a small chair. Hi. Can I see the other one? Where was it? Ten, come ten, here. Ten. I'll show you. Come here. Come here. Saturday morning, we are doing jobs and listening to some very loud music. Jed, yeah. Luke, we need to go get clothes on, baby. Hopi, Hopi, bed made, teeth brush, clothes on. Go, 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 go. Matt's got all the rooms. Vacuuming, curtains, dusting, all that. They had stuff like spilt milk, dead that look, off the music, off the music, nope. Joy, are you helping Faith do her job? Faith has kitchen. Ben, what's your job? I have laundry. Laundry. Hey, you have to wait till the bathrooms are mopped first. Before you put those down. Layla does nothing. Um, got all those eggs the uh, past couple of days from chickens. You would walk in on the urinal. Yay! Sam has bathrooms. Hey Ben, put the cover on the Layla's bed. I'm just waiting until the water gets warm so I can put the plug in and turn on this and wash the dishes. All right. Let's do it. I'm missing a roller blade. Dogs didn't get them. I don't know. Might be in Joy's room. Girl's room. Just show me, Jed. Ready? Go. All right. Good job, Jed. I should have got a before picture here, but here's my pantry. And it was all just disheveled, everything. And so I spent the last two days, pulled everything off the shelf and organized it and kind of tried to label it. Yes, I love to organize. So it's like uh, teas, cereals, Cokes, bulk items. And I just tried to label it to, so the kids know that, you know, all the pasta, canned fruit, vegetables, So, just, I like to, I like to organize, I like to be organized, it just makes me feel organized, I guess, I don't know. These three weeks, what are you doing, John? Oh. Let's see. You see the bird eggs? I don't know, I need to come kind of this direction. Cool. Yeah, you come check it every day? Uh, no, I just bought it today. <laughs> Fill up water, troughs. Mama hen. How many chicks are in here with it with her? Eight. Eight? You can't even see. You see barely one. Good. She jumps out. Ooh, a little much. That's all I have. So we have uh, another hen that's laying on all these eggs down here. So she hatches them and gives them to the big mom. 
Yeah, so she hatches them, and then I guess, what'd she do, give them to the big mom? Yeah. Gives them to her, and then she takes care of them. <laughs> it's like a team effort, I guess, I don't know. We put them, we put them in this hutch for right now, till they get a little bit bigger, and Oh my goodness. Now what are we gonna do? She comes back. He dropped it. <laughs> Go back in there. She went back. Ben's not normally the one that drives the skid steer. Normally Matt does, but this is a great opportunity for Ben to get time in the seat, you know? So. Yeah, come around. Well, I have two of my boys that are there cutting firewood. One's digging it out of the pit, and uh, the other one's cutting it. Then, of course, I heard that when there's a one of our nannies had a kid, goat and uh she's not feeding it so we're gonna have to probably do something about that either hobble her or or something she keeps kicking her kids off we don't have much room for those mamas who don't take care of the babies we get rid of them fast what are you doing Here we are feeding the baby some colostrum, trying to get the baby to revive. Mama's obviously not taking care of it. Faith, this is your goat, right? Yes. You feel it drain? Yeah. You rubbing his throat so he follows? All right, I'm taking the four-wheeler, so y'all come down there when you're done. Okay, you, got you too, huh? I got him out. Yeah, and I haven't even finished cleaning the bathrooms. You oh, bust in. you can get down here then. You'll clean the bathrooms later tonight during the movie time. Take it to him. So we uh gonna go and stock up grandparents first, get their house stocked up. Uh we got a lot, quite a bit already, and then the boys are wanting to sell cords for firewood, so or so they want to sell cords of firewood for extra money, so they want to at least get stuff ready. You know. I also have plans to uh, go and clear out some down in the draw. The draw is dry right now. In the last few years, we actually had a rainy season, so uh, around uh, you know April and May, and it's really kind of all the rain kind of hits, and so we're getting there. Um, before it rains, I want to kind of clear out the draw area, clean it up a little bit. Plus, we can go down there and shoot, shoot guns. So that's kind of my, that's kind of my thinking. I want to shoot some, do some, uh, do some pistol shooting down there. So I gotta get my wife out there to shoot a little bit. She hadn't shot in a while, so it's always awesome watching your wife shoot. I tell you what, guys, something that's pretty hot is watching your wife shoot a gun. I'm just saying, I'm just saying. If you've never done it take her to a gun range and watch her shoot. I don't care how good she is or bad she is. There's just something attractive about that mama bear spirit. You know, that, that mama bear thing in her when you when you get her and you, you prep her with a gun and you give her that ability to defend herself, something comes over them and they start shooting. I don't care if they're a ter terrible shot. It's just kind of pretty attractive, I'm just saying. 
So yeah, is there an ulterior motive to clean out the uh, draw? Could be. So we had a baby goat born. Mom ran off. It looks premature. Like born too early, too little. A goat. A goat. And it doesn't look like it's doing very well. To know what now. It's a goat. I knew it. Oh, yeah, it is a girl. Don't die. Hi, John. Did your boots on? Are you okay? Put a new chain on. Other chain was pretty old. Loosen it up a little bit more. What are you doing? Hey, Looking quite handsome and beautiful, aren't you? Oh. Like oh, you stay over here. Stay over here. You don't go over there. Uh huh? Hey, hey, it's not doing. Yeah, what's Matt doing? He's putting on a chain. There she is, Miss America. You gonna go get me, make me some lunch, woman? Go make you a sandwich. It's awesome. With a lot of meat and cheese. Cheese, mayo. And Miracle Whip. <laughs> Yummy. And then if you'll just sprinkle in some chips. Oh yeah, in the sandwich. Well, no, no, but it's gotta have chips on the plate, you know? And then maybe a Dr. Pepper. Um, Diet Dr. Diet Dr. Pepper. <laughs> Diet Dr. Thunder. Let's Talk go. about the Daddy, breakfast of, cha uh, the lunch of champions. I didn't want to go. Is he gonna stay with you? As long as he stays up there. You have to stay right there. Let's go. Are you instructing him or what? He's just telling him what to do. So Matt's now in. What'd you think of that? It's, it's awesome, isn't it? It's fun. It's like a massive joy. You gotta respect it, but it's... it's... <laughs> you did good. Let's go help him load up any any wood that fits. And those, those. Right now the saw is cooling off, so it just pieces. You want me to go get the bigger one? No, no. What'd you say? Can I go get the big brown What'd you say, Jed? Okay. You ready to go? Yeah, go on to Poppy and Gigi. Ben, you and, I can, you and I can just relax over here by the tree. Well, I don't know how many of y'all know this, but like for this little baby goat to make it, which she is, she looks premature, for her to make it, it is like an hour you're up every hour um, feeding feeding her for a couple of days and then you're up two to three hours after that for a while just to till it gets up on its own and then you're still bottle feeding it so for for people who bring back goats from a state like this I mean it is pretty amazing it's very hard and I, honestly I don't think that she's going to make it just as how tiny she is She's had some colostrum, but we're going to keep trying and see how she goes. Have her getting warm here by a little heater. Try to keep her warm. So, but she was just out there left. Didn't even have her sack cleaned off. Mom abandoned her. So, we're going to do all we can and see what happens. It's relaxing. Kind of comfy, isn't it? Nice breeze. About 65 degrees out right now. Sitting right next to this jumping cactus. Oh, that is in my enemy. I swear they're jumping cactus. Those things do jump at you. Don't they, John? It's almost like they just jump at you to jump on you. Yeah. Absolutely terrible. And you got these cactus. 
These are so terrible. Find all kinds of stuff down here. This is rock base all through here. This is pretty deep right here. Um, remember that one video where uh, we had to get the goats uh, uh, across the river and uh, Sam had to cross the river with my 1911 to shoot the uh, to shoot that one goat that was dying. This is where Sam crossed and it's up to my neck right here. That's how high it was. It was about right here the water was. So it's pretty pretty amazing. Let's go eat lunch. <laughs> Well, we got a baby goat here, moving a little bit. Are you thinking the baby's premature? Yes. Probably gonna die. Even the baby has it's been giving up its strength. We yeah. put the tube down its throat and given it some colostrum. Given it some more colostrum, but and it's some bigger. But you pick it up and you just hold it. The whole body. Hey, what does it do, babe? Do it, do that yeah. for me. Do that. Do it. Uh huh. The whole, it's just a limp rag. There's but no has, strength at all. But it has a little bit of strength to uh, move its legs and lift its ear up. Ow! Its That's paws are soft. Yeah. Its hooves are soft it's even. Hooves. Oh, is it? Its like hooves they're are soft, like they're not developed. Yeah, that's... Well, all babies like that oh. first, but it should be like this. The baby is soft. Oh, it's lunch time. And, uh... I'm waiting on my bride to bring me some food. The baby's will be inside and it's moving its legs. Like... Right. Here you go, baby. Look at this. Oh, chips, yeah. so sun chips, oh, yeah. yes. And then, now look at this, why is this? Why do I have one with bread and one without bread? Because if you wrap it, it takes the calories away. <laughs> <laughs> well, like, so, that's what Jim Gaffigan says. Jim Gaffigan says he uh, no, rabbit. but this, this, this is a little bit healthier version. Yeah. And I gave you one that you would like, so you can either save the one you like for last, or you can eat it first. Okay. And if I want seconds, and can I'll I get any kind I want? Can I get? <laughs> you do a second. Well. That's your first. That's your second. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was saying. You know what I'm missing now? Uh, Diet Dr. Thunder. Diet Dr. Thunder? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, give me that Diet Dr. Thunder. I'll tell you what. <laughs> Who needs Diet Dr. Pepper? So Ben and I, ben and I are out here for a walk. And he's got his goats out here. I swear, God's the Lord's trying to tell Ben to be a, a goat farmer. Because every single goat you get always has what? Two or three or four goats? Yeah. yeah his his herd grows faster than anybody else's herd. That's the, that's the first time uh, I've only had one goat at a time. <laughs> really? Yeah. Your other ones have what, three and four? Yeah. At a time. That's awesome. And yet our goats are brothers and sisters of your goats, and yet your goats are the ones that always... Yeah. Reproduce faster. Mm -hmm. Maybe Lord's telling you something. What? Ben's my goat rancher. See Ben. Ben also oversees the uh, the garden, so he is the farmer and the rancher in our family. That's cool. I can see that. I can see that. Ben knows right now that the market for these goats is really, really good. He can get like 30, 40 pound kid, he can get 150 bucks, close to 150 bucks. So, obviously there's a give and take to all that, but he's smart. Because he'll sell a few. If he ever needs a couple hundred bucks, he just sells one or two goats. This kid's awesome. Growing up, learned to take care of his own stuff and be responsible. Still a teenager sometimes, <laughs> right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> awesome, nonetheless. Ooh, look at that. You like 
that in your foot. Talking about throwing axes. John just disappears up the tree. Always in a tree. Can't hardly see him. He's always in a tree. Always. Mama, what's Mama doing? She is working out. You brought me my drink? Yes, and her is pills. Yo. How's your baby goat doing? It's dying. It's dying, you think she'll make it? No. Dad, where's uh, the uh, your drink? My drink? Yeah. <laughs> Can kind of drink it? Yeah, you have a drink. Yee. Well, we got done grubbing a little bit and cutting some firewood. I can't cut firewood. And now we are swinging Daddy and the little ones. And about to go and play some volleyball. Have movie night. You what? You ready to get down? Yeah. Daddy. All right. Daddy. Well, it's been a good day. We've worked hard. Time to play hard a little bit. Have movie night tonight, and then we're gonna go ahead and uh, Daddy. just uh, Daddy. enjoy our family time Daddy. on Saturday. Got church Daddy. in the morning Daddy. via live stream, Daddy. like a lot of people are doing. A weird world we're living in, isn't it? So, hopefully. It'll go back to normal, about a year. It'll be back to normal. I know, everybody will be more conscientious of germs, but eh. we'll never do this again, I'll tell you that. Starting to see all the data coming in from this virus. The truth is coming out now. So, I know hindsight's 2020, but data is still the data. The truth is coming out. What? Oh, I got a very pregnant milk cow out there. She's huge. Huge. And she's moody too. <laughs> anyway, all right, guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. We'll see you later. So, something I didn't mention. This little baby goat is getting worse. It's starting to choke, and uh, we have to put her down. So I gotta do it at a time when my daughter's not paying attention. She's actually asked me to put him down, but she doesn't know, wanna know when. So, I had to put down plenty of goats. And actually, um, goats that weren't this far off. So, this one's starting to arch their neck back. And if you have goats, you know, when that happens, it's pretty much a death sentence. So, she wants me to make it. Quick and painless, so I can do that. I'll just have to do it later on. That's what daddy's gotta do sometimes.